Hi guys, it's Michelle. Welcome to my channel, Grateful Creations. Well, this will probably be the last painting of the year, but I'm not sure because I'm always experimenting. Well, this is definitely not going to be an experiment. It's something I've done before. As a matter of fact, I did it on my spinner. However, this time I am going to do it all with um, TLP piggies mixed into my paints. So this is Macaw and Twinkle. And that went into Amsterdam greenish blue. And that's what it came up with. So I did put a fair amount of pigment in with these paints. This is Pinwheel. And I put that into, uh, this is Pebeo, do, 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 Violet Cobalt Dark. And I think I have a squirt of Liquitex um, dioxazine purple in there too. So that made a beautiful shimmery color. So all these are gonna be shimmering on this canvas. This is Sapphire. And that went into a Matisse Indigo. It's gorgeous. And these two, which is a uh, Nikki favorite, Twilight and Groovy, I finally got the name right. And that went into Pebeo Iridescent uh, Blue Violet. Just gorgeous. And this is Lemon Sorbet. And that went into Amsterdam Titan Yellow. Just gorgeous. And I do have some white. And that will be for in between the layers. So I am going to start with flooding my canvas. I just have Liquitex. I'm sorry, it's not Liquitex. It's Artist Loft Flow White. I did put a little bit of Decorate satin enamels in it. So it's going to be like a ninja swipe, as uh, Sarah calls it. And uh, it's a Kaylin Schaub inspired piece. But, okay, I'm just going to spread this out. I love working on a spinner. I already prepped my corners and edges with um, some straight Artist Love Flow White or soft body, whatever you want to call it these days. I'm hoping they come back with the old formula. It would be certainly nice. But uh, we'll look forward to that hopefully in 2022. Um, I did want to let you guys know, in my latest mixing video, I said to use the Bare Scuff Defense. I don't know if they've changed their formula, but I've found that the Bare 7300 7, works better for the, um, the pearl pores. So the 7300 is, oh, geez Louise this one so this is the one you want to get um i guess the better the deep base the better results you're going to get so i just wanted to let you know about that okay so i'm gonna kind of do the same well i better torch it first a ton of bubbles <laughs> Still have problems. All right, that's enough. And this is 
a 20 by 20 gallery wrapped artist loft um, deep edge and one of my favorite sizes. And so I'm going to start, I'm not gonna put a lot in, in on. I'm gonna start with the turquoise. And I love purple next to turquoise. And then I'm going to put some white. Oops, I got stuck. I think I put a little abalone shell in this from Color Art. And then some of the deep blue. That's the indigo. Oopsie. Oh, that was easy. Then some of the pink. a little bit of white, just a little, and then some yellow. I don't have any green in this one this time, although we can make green right now if we want. Um, what else do I want to put on there? Hmm. I think we want to put some more turquoise, that'll make some green. turns out beautiful. Uh, I have some swipe tools here. And I found that it, you can only swipe once. Once you start uh, spinning, you can't swipe again. So let's see how this works out. Nice. Ooh, there's a lot of blue. We've got lots of effects happening. I love that. All right. I think that's enough. I'm going to give it a minute or two. Look at all the cells. And everything's going to pop up a bit. And I'm going to torch it right now. Look at that turquoise coming through. Oh, my goodness. Oh, jeez. Easier. Yeah, all the colors popped up on my last one. Well, I shouldn't say my last one. I should say the one that I've got underneath it here. Now, I'm not sure I like that center. I think I need more color. It's all like that dark blue is taken over. Let me put a little bit of pink and then some yellow. Make like a... There we go. That's what I'm talking about. All right, I'm gonna leave those two there. Yeah, I wanted some um, peachy kind of colors. There are some coming up through here. I'm gonna leave this for a few minutes, guys. I am, but I like it so far. I'm probably gonna lose all of this. So pretty too. Oh, I wonder if I can you know what I can do? Do I want to do that? I want to keep it. You know, it's going to... Eh, I'll let it. I'll let it go. I might do another one too. I just, I have extra paint. So if this, these uh, pores don't take a lot of color. So um, 
you can do many. Oh, this is so pretty. Oh, and I'm glad I put the pink and the yellow in too. Oh yeah, oh yeah. I wish I had more um, turquoise. It might come up yet. I put it on the bottom though. I put some on the top. Eh. There are many more paintings to do, Michelle. <laughs> this isn't the last one you're doing. All right, guys, so I am going to spin it out. Here we go. A lot of blue. Okay, and so that turquoise is coming up, but I will tilt it this way. Look at those cells, holy cow. All right, here we go. There we go, now it's rocking and rolling. Okay, 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 okay. Enough, enough. Okay, I'm happy. I'm really super happy. Oh yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Um, I'm gonna tip this just a little bit this way to unwonk these cells. I am so thrilled. Oh, this is my favorite painting to do that these days. Okay, so I might do another one. You should see the sides. The sides are gorgeous. All right, guys, that's a pretty um, quick video, eh? get some of these the sides with bear can't have bear sides and I'm gonna take you down for a close-up and I'm gonna put this on the side and I might do some I might do a Dutch pour with these wouldn't that be fun colors. I'm dying to see what it looks like with the flash on. All right. I think I've got all my corners done. Oop, almost. It's always good to get, it's very professional to fix your, your sides and your corners. Otherwise it's, it looks kind of shoddy. Okay. All right. I am going to turn you off for a moment or two, let this develop a little bit more, and I will be back. All right, guys, I'm in love with this. So it's a fireworks. <laughs> it reminds me of fireworks, I don't know why. <laughs> so, oh yeah, you can't see the sparkle. This is the first time I'm seeing it. Look at that. That's that sapphire. Ooh, la, la. And the yellow got eaten up, but there's little tiny cells that are coming through. Um, so this is like a ninja pearl spin out. And I'm loving every inch of it. So I'm either gonna do another one or I'm going to do a Dutch pour with these colors. Or I can do another one like this and layer the colors differently so you can see how different it would look. No two paintings will ever be the same in fluid art. Look at that. That is like my favorite. These pearls are So there was some pearl mix in there. See where I swiped? Look. Wow. And that um, that um, indigo is a 
transparent color. So it really, I mean, it, you've got so many hues of it in here. It almost took over. So I'm really happy. Those got smooshed a bit. But look at those. Yippee, yokai. Please be safe and create. Please like, share, and subscribe. And ciao for now.